guys, welcome back to Guvi's YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to talk about a data science interview. How easy to crack the data science in data science. You can apply any job role in data science, but you can apply any concepts in this concept. You can apply it easy to crack the data science. But before you go to the video, please subscribe to our channel. First of all, you need to strengthen your statistical concepts because they will ask you about population, sample and the difference between them. They will also test your knowledge and concepts such as central limit theorem, p-value and its significance, hypothesis testing and regression analysis. Next, you need to strengthen your machine learning concepts including supervised and unsupervised learning with their differences. Also concepts such as overfitting and ways to avoid them. Cross-validation, bias variance trade-off and classification and regression also with their differences. After that, you have to strengthen your programming skills because they might ask you questions like how would you handle a missing data in a data set? The difference between Python and R in data science. They might also ask you to write a function to find the mean in a given list and concepts like NumPy and Pandas in data science. Next comes the data analysis where they might test your knowledge about EDA that is nothing but exploratory data analysis feature engineering and they might also ask you about your process of handling outliers in data set and the difference between correlation and causation. Next, you need to strengthen your big data concepts including Hadoop and its relevance to data science, MapReduce paradigm, Spark and how it is different from Hadoop. Next, you need to strengthen your SQL concepts where they might ask you to write an actual SQL query, for example, to find the second highest salary in a given table. And also, they might ask you about concepts like join in SQL, order by, group by and the differences between them. Next, to test the depth of your knowledge, they might ask you questions related to real-world problems using case studies. For example, they might ask you about your approach to a given real-world business problem using data science. They might also ask about your projects, the challenges that you have faced and how you have overcome. They might also give you a data set and ask you to determine if it's suitable for regression analysis or not. Next, they'll check your basic communication skills including how would you explain a very complex technical concept to a non-technical stakeholder. Also, how would you handle disagreement with the team members if handling a project? Nextly, you have to stay up to date with the latest trending tools and technologies used in the industries because they might ask you questions like the purpose of Jupyter Notebooks in data science and about cloud platforms like AWS, Azure and Google Cloud. Lastly, the important concept that you must be familiar with is ethics in data science because they will ask you questions such as how would you handle bias in machine learning models? What are the ethical considerations while working with sensitive data. Always remember that in addition to all this technical knowledge, the interviewer will also be looking for your problem solving skills, critical thinking and your ability to communicate complex concepts. If you have a good end of this video, hopefully you will be able to crack your dream job easily. If you want to like this video, please like, share and comment. Don't forget to subscribe to Guvi.